Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to set up email notifications for specific emails in Gmail. So this is not a super straightforward procedure since they don't really have an option for this. So this is kind of a workaround and it might take a little bit of a training on your part for Google to get the uh, procedure correct here. So what we need to do first is make sure that notifications are turned on in your Gmail. So in your Gmail account, go to your settings, see all settings, scroll down to notifications, desktop notifications, and you want to have important mail notifications on, not new mail notifications because that'll do everything. You want important mail notifications, and then you can change the sound if you like as well. And then if you have a link up here that says enable desktop notifications, which will be right up here, then you need to click that to turn it on. Uh, this one's already been activated, so that's why it's not there. And then just make sure you go down and click save changes when you're done. And then you want to go up to uh, filters and blocked addresses. So we want to set up a filter for this email address that we want to have a notification for. So we're going to click on create a new filter and put in the address. We want to do Todd Sims at Outlook.com. So anything from him we want to be notified on. So you don't need to fill out any of this stuff. Just click on create filter. And then make sure you check the box here. Always mark it as important. And then create the filter. Okay, so now we'll uh, try it out here. So we'll uh, send something from the uh, address that we want notifications for to Cindy here. Go back to Gmail, wait for it to come in. So we got our whistle sound, then we also got our Windows notification with our Windows notification sound. So if you don't want the Windows notification sound, you can go to your settings. Then you want to find notifications. Then look for Google Chrome. You could turn it off altogether, but that'll turn off any Chrome notifications, so you might not want that. So if you expand this, then you can turn off the sound when notification arrives. Um, so this is also going to apply to other Chrome notifications, so it's up to you if you want to disable that. So with that disabled, let's try another one. Okay, so now we just got the whistle sound and we didn't get the uh, window sound. Okay, so now you can see these are marked as important. That's why we got the notification. So now let's try something else here from another account that we don't want notifications for. But you can see we got a notification for it and that's because Gmail decided to mark it as important. So what you need to do is go into your important Highlight the mail here, and then click on mark as not important, and then let's try it again. And it still did it, so sometimes you have to do this a couple times. So let's do it again. Let's put this three for third time. Okay, so that time we didn't get a notification and it wasn't marked as important because we told Google that or told Gmail that it's not important. So you're gonna have to do that uh, for emails that you don't want to have notifications for or you don't want marked as important. So like I said, it's just kind of a, you know, it's not the best solution, but it's one way to get notifications for emails that you definitely want to get notifications for. You just might get notifications for others that you don't necessarily want notifications for because they're marked as important. And I don't know if you're going to want to mark everything else as not important because you still might want other emails to be marked as important. So this is going to be completely up to you how you configure this. But I figured I would just show you the way to add, you know, a little bit of customization to your Gmail notifications for specific addresses. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.